Hey guys and welcome back to Bermuda Lost Survival. Uh, we're exactly where we left off last time uh, in the middle of the night uh, because I got really thirsty and that's when I woke up. Um, so what time? How do I see what time it is? It's around here, isn't it? Uh, sleep. So we're around here. So I might as well just stay up now. There's no point in me going to bed. Um, so what I need to do is a little gander where he was and try and like just recoup my thoughts and feelings on this game like where I am. So this is what I need to do. Build that. Okay. Got 18 sticks, no, 18 planks, 9 sticks. So I need to get more, I need to go and explore and get more stuff. And then this is the new workbench that I made. Which allows me to make stairs, allows you to make, I need to get fire scrap metal, 8 sticks, so I can make a barbecue bucket. It's a simple cooking station. I get water distillery, which is obviously, dis uh, I get distilling salt water into drinkable clean water. So that's what I need to make next, really, to quench my thirst. Um, I need to learn how to actually get food, for one. Uh, chest, storing stuff, wooden door, with a window, a torch, which is just a light source. Dock is used to construct, maintain, and upgrade a raft. I need to make a dock. So I can actually make a raft. And I realize you can press M and there's a map, right? So look, from what I've seen, I've read in the comments or the discuss sorry, the discussion, uh, the forum board of this game uh, on Steam, just so I like, kind of like, could work out what was going on in the game. These are the only two areas that are actually currently available. Because uh, it's early access, they're going to add all these areas up soon. I don't know why these are greyed out, I don't know what that means. And maybe there's something to be uncovered there, I don't know. So right now, I can explore this one, and I can explore this one. And that's it. So apparently that's like five hours of playtime, so obviously... Uh, we'll try and get that done. And then we'll see, by, maybe by that point... I won't, I'll post this daily, I'll post it whenever I get the chance to post it. Because I've got... I'm working to get ahead on a lot of videos recently, as we're very busy, as you may have seen. Um, so whatever, I'll try not to post this too often, and then hopefully by the time that I've got to that point, then hopefully they've updated the game, we can carry on where we are. So, uh, I need to do something. Um, I guess it's very dark down here, and I imagine the sharks attack at night or something. That's what I'm, I feel like that's be a feasible thing to happen. Um, yeah, so I need to work out how I'm going to catch fish. So I have this spear, which I know I can now hold down to hold down to uh, kind of like pre-aim it and I can release it when I get close to a fish. We need to get into this school of fish over here who just swim away from me. So that's, oh my god. Can I attack the shark? Probably not a good idea, is it? I'll swim past me, please. Oh, uh, it's so hard to catch fish. Oh. I feel like it was close. Anyway. Bun off the fish. I need to get Scrap metal, I need to get sticks, I need to get planks. I've been down here and wasted, oh my god, there's a score fish right here. Pre-aim and fire. Oh. Pre-aim and fire. How is that not getting them? You have to be kidding me. How was, look, go on. Sorry, surely. Am I like, I'm special with I cannot catch these fish. Are these fish too small for me? I feel like I quite clearly hit them. I saw someone do this on video, right? I was just doing my research. There we go. That was it. Um, now what? Oh, wait, there's blood. Are you sure that's bad? Blood's bad. Blood's bad because of sharks. Oh my god. Okay, I'm going to get away from that area ASAP because I feel like he's going to get angry. No sharks in their blood, they get a bit excited, didn't they? Right, let's just get that oxygen bar back. That's a nice little sight. Visuals in this game are really nice. Let's get back under. So I just need to collect resources, really. That's basically what I, should, maybe what I could have done before starting this episode was do, like, go out and just get all the resources possible. So I was, like, much more uh, ready just to do, like, building this episode and exploring more. But I guess I should show you the whole process. I'm going to harvest this, get some scramble from these barrels. Doink. Doink. Fire from each. That shark seems awfully close, but it's fine. So far, sharks seem quite friendly and not angry, which is strange. To have a game of sharks in and then not be attacking you every two seconds. I'm just so used to Stranded Deep. The Stranded Deep was like, literally, you get in the water, the shark was nearby, he weren't having none of it. He was ready to just pounce on you. Um, so I believe this luminous coral actually has no use right now as well, to answer that question that I... Uh, Raised in a previous episode. 
me collect some of these sticks and stuff down here. But this game like requires a lot of resources to do stuff, uh, which is a good and a bad thing because it means it takes a while to actually get all your resources and get further into the game. It gives you more play time. Um, it could also be quite long-winded and re repetitive, but I don't know. I kind of like it. I like these games. I feel like I feel like this game's making me realise I probably would really have enjoyed Subnautica, uh, and that game looks like it's much more in depth than this one. So if that's a game you definitely think any of you guys have watched it and think I should play it, then you need to let me know. I think everyone's going to say yes. Maybe it's worth giving it a try. Well, so many people, so many people have done it. That's the thing. I've been a hipster and playing a game that not many people have played yet. Okay, dying. Up we go. Up we go. Don't get caught on this. Is our raft right there? I think it is. It's gonna be perfect. I can put that stuff in my inventory as well. It's still not even daytime. My sleep schedule in this game is gonna be useless. I mean, one fish, which I can't really do anything with at this moment in time. Um, so. I can build random bits and bobs. Nothing too impressive. The boy, I need ropes. I need more seaweed. For the workbench, what do I need to build anything that's interesting? So, basically, I should get the water distillery done. So, that's 12 scrap metal, 4 planks, 8 sticks, which I, can, I think I can do already. I'm pretty sure I can do that. Um, scrap, was it scrap metal? And then planks and sticks. I'll take that all over. We'll just see what it's saying. Uh, no. The water city requires 12 scrap metal, 4 planks, and 8 sticks. I need to move over there, why. Silly me being an idiot. Right. Water distillery. Craft. So that will be done. Move this into here. But the building in this game is actually quite in depth and will actually be pretty sick. I guess it should go like that. It's how does this work? I need to get a bottle, right? To get a bottle, I need to go to here. A fire scrap metal, two sticks, one rope. So I need to go on a seaweed mission. Seaweed and sticks. Although, I've actually got eight rope from here. I've left all my stuff in here. I can make a standing torch. It should be worth making, actually. Let me make it. Let me take a torch, just so I get a light source when it's when it's dark of an evening. I've got a light source just in case there's a chance that I end up getting lost or something. Uh, light source. And it. Wait, it's tiny, like really tiny. That's it? That's a torch? I mean, that's more of a torch right there. Look at that. Just take this off and you'll be fine. Uh, okay, so I need to put, I guess I need to put, do I need to get a bucket or something? Um, seaweed, leave that. Leave the seaweed in there. Get this. Uh, take this seaweed. If I can be special. There we go. If I can hit. The similar sounds are trying to deep now. I can hear sharks underneath me. At least it feels like that's the sound of sharks. Um, workbench. What else can I make? Make a window, which is useless to me right now. So let's leave all that stuff out there. Let's put that stuff back into my box. Can I make a bucket in this one? No. Right, let's put all this back into my, into my crafting box. Rope. Uh, planks. Sticks. Scrap metal. It should be seaweed there. Let's make it a bit more organized, right? Stone. Rope. That's random plants, and that'd be that's random plants at the bottom. Stone here. And then seaweed and seaweed byproducts. There we go. So, we need to get down under. I mean, just to basically rinse this whole area of everything it's got. All the resources it's got, we need to just 
destroy it, and once you've got all the stuff you feel like we need to get, wait, harvest it with knife. Uh, and then, once on that, we'll, I guess we have to get the raft and move on to the next area. But for today, I guess the aim is just to try and get as many resources done from here, get some building done, get some bits and bobs uh, made that I've not made yet. Um, so I have like all the random bits, like the water distillery, the barbecue bucket, whatever it is. That just sounds like KFC. <laughs> just the barbecue figgy. How much seaweed do I need? I just need to make that bottle. So I need to get. That's why I'm getting seaweed for the rope. Scrap metal. Um, there's all these bits of planks and stuff down here. Basically, got to dive under, grab as much stuff as I can, and then come back up, put it into my, my box, and then carry on. I think Strand Deep actually had some updates as well. Um, so I don't know how far different, it, how much different it is from before. I don't think it's a game that I'll revisit now. Though. I think I'll just leave it. Um, and we'll move on to other survival games that we can find. Like I said, like obviously this game right now hasn't got many legs to stand on, so we probably won't end up doing this for a long time. But let's look into Subnautica. Um, I know the game Raft that I played before. Uh, that's coming out again next year, but on Steam, which we sick. Um, and I hope it's been updated a lot. Yeah, any more survival games like this that you know, that's in the water, can be just like a game basically where I'm out here collecting stuff. I, I, these are games I feel, I feel like I really like. Why is my heart still beating? Is that a glitch? I'm out of the water. It's first. Oh no. I feel like my oh no, I got one left. So I need to get the bottle done. The bottle has to get done. So there's no fucking about anymore. I need to get that bottle. Um, okay, take that seaweed over there, and that stone can go into here. Right, so you go into here, run. That's making ten rope. So what do I need for a bottle? I need five scrap metal, two sticks, one rope. Only one rope. I got that. I have enough for this bottle. Easy, 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 easy. Um, where is it? Where is it? Rope, sticks, and plank, and scrap metal. Just put it all in there. Uh, unlock. Right, so I have that. Ten iron to improve the bottle. When do you find that stuff? Screw it. For now. We got the bottle. Right, what do I do with the bottle now, though? Okay, let me put this back in here. I feel like one of these things over here is going to turn the bottle be over in the workbench. One of this should turn the bottled water into something normal, right? It's a simple cooking station. That's to cook. Would it be the water distillery of the bottle? I don't know what would be... Let me take this bottle into water. Hang on. Wait, I've just collected some water. Can I just hold it? Okay, I can just collect some water like it's nothing. Then what does it do? So I'm collecting all this water. Alright, ten to water, that's good. I feel like I could collect that forever. And what does one do with ten to water? Do I just put it in here? No? This is food, must be refined. FX tastes salty. This is food, must be ref this is food, can be cooked. It can be refined first, isn't that what a distillery would do? Surely that is what I need to do, I need to put it into the... Do I just drink it? Is it fine? No, it looks like my first went down. It doesn't seem good. No, I'm now really thirsty. So water was bad. Really bad. Oh my god, I'm dying. No, grab. Wait, it's my last supplies though. This 
is not good. This is not good. It's not good. Not good. Not good. Not good. No, guys, that we not good. No, please, game. No, um, fuck. Um, what do I need to do? Workbench. No, none of these. None of these fix my issue. How does one? Why does that not work? Be more, more water than that. What happens when my first one's out? That's the issue. Do I? Oh, I don't want to die. I don't want to die. We've been here, we've been out here too long doing this, grinding this. Get me out. I see that there's more help. No, you can't run it still. Split. Doesn't do anything. Oh. Oh no. Supplies are gone. Wait, how does one? It has to be, no, it has to be the cooking station. Has to be, has to be, has to be, has to be, has to be. Take this, take this. Is that enough sticks? Be enough sticks, please. Need enough sticks. <laughs> this, this. No, scrap metal. <laughs> Where's the metal? It's in the work. Where's the metal? Where'd my metal go? Guys? Uh oh. Uh oh. Need scrap metal. Lost it. Scrap metal. Come on. Where you at? Metal, metal, metal. Anything metal. Please. Barrels, barrels, barrels. Plane. There's a plane at the top left corner. They're alright, wasn't there? Please. Does my health go down? Yeah, my health's going. Okay, I'm dying. I'm dying real fast. No, I'm dead. You survived two days? No! No! Hurt yourself! What? Wait, 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 wait. I got the stuff though. I got the stuff. It just re Wait. Okay, so I'm back. I mean, I can fuck with that, but also can't. I get a lifeline. Right, well. That's <laughs> that's that stress over. I was gonna say I just didn't want to die and have to do that all over again. Not not that I'd actually progress far. It could have got a lot worse. I'm assuming I need to make a small barbecue bucket thing. Um, then that's where metal went. Uh, if I make that bucket, then I assume it will cook the salt water. I mean, I pray. I don't really know what else it could be. We're going to harvest the hell out of this plane. Will this plane disappear though? That'd be sad. I feel like I'm just hit this for a, lot, a long, long time. Doink. Can I get, like, how much are we going to get that? It's 40 or something, maybe? Can you get 40 out of the wood? So imagine you can get 40 out of the ships. So imagine you can get 40 out of this as well. Oh my god, 21. And it just goes. That poor plane, just gone. Any memory of it? It's disappeared. That's why this blue triangle exists. That's why it's so weird and things disappear there. Because if you crash a plane, some guy comes along and just whacks it to bits. To just get 21 scrap metal. Just so he can build his little bucket <laughs> at sea. I eight eight sticks. Ah, oh. really just need to go on a crazy supply mission, don't I? Really? Ah, oh, scrapmetal's there again. They respawned. This will respawn as well. I'm liking this respawn system. Oh my god! Right now, I think this game's like 
then we've got potential. Like I said that a lot about I said that I say that a lot about a lot. I say that a lot about a lot of games. Um This one generally does. Actually, you know, everything I say about it genuinely does. I just <laughs> I only play games that do have potential when I do play them. Like I said, I spent my life on Steam. So like any games coming out in the next three months, I've probably got it locked in and ready to go if it's actually bit ready and it's been seen on Steam. I least spent all the time trying to find these games to play. And half the time I don't have playing them. I see any multiplayer ones we do play. But any single player games, I end up just like saving them, like, yeah, I'll play that, I'll play that. And then I end up just not doing it. Because I have so many like group videos to post. Alright, let me just I'm just literally gonna try and get as much stuff as possible before I go back go back up. Go on. Right, give me all this. If I just go to like, if I can find that shipwreck, it's one top top right of the HUD. I can get all that stuff. And I can go and get sticks galore over there. You can see there's a stick here too, even though it's pitch black. Stones over here, but stone. We found out stones are pretty much useless once you've got your first tools. I guess if you look to it, uh, improve them. They need repairing at some point. I don't know if they have durability or what. Actually, no signs of them breaking anytime soon, though. Imagine I go for all this effort to make a bucket, and it turns out that the bucket isn't my solution. Now be a bit of a nightmare. Okay, it's just, it's just a cooking station. Like. The water distillery seems to be the only place that should that should work in. I'm kind of confused as to why it doesn't work. Then I'm supposed to be doing. I put two things in. I'm supposed to put like two items in to make it work. Like the, the bucket of water and then tank else. Because I think I'm pretty sure this is just used to cook. I'm just going to cook fish on it. I mean, I've got a fish, so I'm happy to do that, because I'm, I'm out of supply, so I am going to need to cook now anyway. Like, do I just... Wait, where's... Where's... Where's the water at? I had like 16 water. Where's the water gone? The like, game's gone nuts. That's where I've lost stuff. I've got it. Who cares? Alright, it's all water situation. Let me just try this again. If you're selling me, right? If I. Where's my fish gone? My fish and my water were stolen from me. I think they stole my food and drink when I died. It makes sense. So did, I've built something that is purely designated to cooking or di distilling salt water into clean water. And I have salt water. I've collected it. Bottled up. All good. 15 of them. Right. I come over to my water distillery. But I can't run it. Why... Am I unable to run that? That that seems strange to me. Can I put it on here? Nope. So it's not that either. The bucket won't save me. There's something about this that I'm doing wrong. Maybe I'm being very special here. Is there another way of doing that? <laughs> I'm really confused. Like, really confused. Why wouldn't that work? Because I, I can't survive unless I can do this water situation. This is really going to baffle me. It only is that water. Can I. What do I do with it? Why should I put the water in there? 
I pour it in. Hmm. I'm going to investigate. Right. It's as I've probably kind of guessed, but just didn't actively think to do and try. Obviously, you need to be burning in order for it to work. So, split. Split in half. Bonk that in there. Run. There we go. Seven clean water on the way. Should be the same thing for this, I guess. I assume... Do I, just, do that, I think that's in life itself. But that's now cooking the water. So that's good. I don't know where the fish went. Screw the fish. He's gone missing. That goes back into here. You go back into here. And I know what I can and can't make. So, I need to build a lot more items. I need to get more stuff still. And while that's... I mean, I'm not thirsty right now. So let's go back down and get some more bits and bobs. At least we've learned something today, right? We've learned that I need uh, to use planks to burn in order to do the water. Let me go over to the other ship. Something that doesn't actually respawn is ship resources. I've noticed floor resources respawn. Um, but resources from like one of these things over here, those big ship wrecks or like a plane. Anything from the wrecks don't respawn. Things around it do respawn though. Because what I can do right here is just cheat the system a little bit, you know. Go up to it with my little knife. Harvest bad boy amounts of sticks. But two at a time. Very, very simple. Very, very easy. Very, very normal. And it just saves me going and like just sitting there and collecting stick after stick after stick after stick. And I can just sit here, hold it down, and just get myself like 40 sticks in the space of no time at all. And that should, be, that should allow me to build some more stuff. Get the, I'll do planks on the other shipwreck over there that's just ahead of me. That's how many sticks I can get before I'm too heavy. I think it's the planks that'll be heavy actually, not the sticks. I'm oh, 42 sticks. So let's keep going. This is just stick galore. Now how many sticks I need, I've got them. It still won't be enough as well, because to actually build stuff on this game requires a lot of stuff. You can't just go out doing it willy-nilly. I might drown before I even get all my sticks. Oh my god, I can really get a lot of sticks. I didn't even get this many sticks. Do you think I can make sticks into planks? That's something I'd be interested to do. They should let you do that, like Minecraft, you know, put like X amount of sticks together and you get plank. Do I swim it back over? Don't drown, please, 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 please. That's close. Oof. Uh, where's my actual... Oh, it's there. I'll take these sticks back for the sake of it right now. And I can get myself... I can still have a clean water. I mean, the water situation, realistically, it's quite simple. I've also got enough planks, so I can make water real easy. Water. Water. I think I'm saying water. But I am saying water, aren't I? Uh, 82. Alright, so now I can make stairs. I can make all that stuff. Make six of those. I don't need six of those, though. I don't need all of those. This is nearly done, too fair. What's this? Charcoal. A basic crafting material. To so get a byproduct from that. That's kind of sick. And I got seven clean water. Put that in my little craft. It's not craft. I need a store. Yeah. Let me make a st storage box. I can actually rename them as well. That's perfect for what I need. But you know me, I'm going to have to get really organized in a bit as well. Because obviously this, I mean, this would be my workstation area. I need to build like an actual area. But. Let me take this back over. How much can I actually build? That's not you from burning. Don't need burning anymore. Right, what can I build from what I've got? Yeah, I need some scrap metal. I can make two platforms. I can make a wall. Don't know how tall walls are. Six drying racks. A low wall. A door frame. A window frame. It's a wooden frame in general. I guess that's just like, kind of give yourself structure. Wooden ceiling. So let's get some platforms going, right? Craft or... 
I want to expand my raft. It's bigger. What's oh, not a raft. What is it? Expand my platform area. Well, I shouldn't be using up my materials because I do need... I thought it should be a glitch then. Right. As so we go... Wait. I craft them and leave them in there. I did, didn't I? Let's have to see if my uh, little light works. Oh, it is. Look, it's on now. And snap. But I want to rotate. And snap. We'll snap in a second. And rotate. Yeah. Expanding. I like this. This way this game gets good. Okay. So, I am... See, that's my, so the brain is my sanity, apparently. So do I actually have a tired... I, mean, just, I just get hungry and thirsty. Let's, let's go and get some, let's get some fish. Let's get myself a fish. I had a fish and I've lost him. But I've got myself a place I can cook right now. So let's get myself a fish. Or multiple, if we can get multiple. What's that over there? I think it's going to be the sun or the moon. Come on, come on. Ah, oh, so close. Come on, please. Yeah, fish. Grab it. How many fish can we get? Oh, sharks! In, is that good? No, sharks definitely. He's definitely coming. Oh my god! Okay, they seem friendly. I think sharks are alright in this game for now. I guess until they update it, sharks won't be an issue. And now the fish is getting easier. As long as you're in the school of fish, you just gotta make sure you have it held down. See a fish come past you. And then, wait, 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 fish, oh, shark, fuck, <laughs> oh my, nice and easy. When a shark crosses your path, you just give him a little tap, you know, a little love tap. And I don't know, is this fish going to survive for long? Let me really go out of date. Let's get some planks so I've got the chance. And then I'll swim up as soon as my beat, heart starts beating. It's beating already, isn't it? Yep. I guess I could go get some more. Let's recover fully. There we go. Right, let's go back down. I think I'll sell some more planks. Just so I can build more stuff by the time I get back over there. Don't want to waste my time, you know? I've only got like 10 planks back there. Let's give myself like a healthy amount of planks. See, I want to know if it was like an unlimited amount of sticks I can get, because it is an unlimited amount of sticks, and it's smart just to harvest like chests and chests and chests full of sticks first from a shipwreck, and then go and get the planks. Oh, my first is right down now. Luckily, the planks is finished. So now I need to test out a clean water works, which I know it will, and I've got fish I can cook as well. Right, I get it. My heart's beating. I think how, how many times do you think I get? Like, do you think it's just a case of like, you get as many goals as you want, you just get how many days you've survived? Because that kind of, it almost ruins the game a little bit that like I've died and I'm still here. It should have reset. It would've been really harsh, I know, but it probably should have reset. Um, I think it's in my crafting box, isn't it? No, it's just in my, I had it here. I didn't need to go down. It's only that good to need two of them. Right, where's my cooking bucket over here? So the fish, I need to again put planks in. I think the charcoal is a byproduct that you can use to cook. I think I just need charcoal. Guess we can find out. While it's here, just donk. Collect some salt water. But how much does it collect? I mean, sure there's any excellent water that will go in here. Should be one at a time, right? 
just for realism, it should be one at a time. I have to go down, open it, close it, go up, down. I mean, it'd be long, but it'd be realistic because at this point, I've just got, I'm holding 14 bottles of water in one, so in one bottle. Let's get to 20. Let's go 24 actually, so it makes 25 total. 23 and 24. Right, there we go. Um, so let me go to here. Nope, wrong one, sorry. Go to here. That's, that's not cooking, so we know the charcoal itself. You need wood. So what does the charcoal actually do? It's a crafting material. What can it be used? Do I need to maintain this? Like, does it just cook roasted fish? Hmm. So I have a nice roasted fish. I'm living good now. I'm living good. I guess maybe you just, the longer you survive, you just get more skills. Okay. So, where was all that? Guys, did I not have a ton of planks? I'm noticing Sank here. Sank's gone wrong. Did I put them all in there? Is that what it was? I think it was. I say, I swear I've gone nuts. All right. We've got the planks in here. Now, I've got a lot of sticks over here, right? 58 sticks and 10. What do I even want? What do I want to make? That's the thing, yeah. Let me split. Like that and like that. Cool. So that's fine. So that's my building materials. I'll take this over to this side. Oh god, I need to, basically I need to split up my collection of stuff. And work out what I want to build next. So stairs are unnecessary. Chests could be necessary for storage, but right now I'm not really struggling for storage. Wooden door. Uh, do I make an actual, like maybe I have a building? Let's have a platform made. And let's have like a building structure that has a door. And the outside is the workstation area. I need 12 planks, 12 sticks. All this transferring from place to place. Maybe I should keep it all in my crafting area for now because I'm probably going to do building stuff. The sticks is fine actually. Uh, one, that's what I can make. One. It's a pretty long process, this whole building bit, isn't it? I can still make one door frame. So let's make that door frame. I can always make one low wall. Just make one low wall while I've got the chance. My railing would look better. It really would. Yeah, oh well. Right, so. If I go to the hammer. And I scroll, shift and scroll, snap, rotate, there we go. So in the wall, I would have it. Just on the outskirts, you know, like a little, like a little garden. Uh, yeah, that makes sense. What's on that side of the fence? Same either side. That's cool. And then the door frame would go here. And there we go. All right, there's our early beginnings, our humble beginnings of what I'm looking to make for the future. Now I can make another standing torch. I'll match up over the other side. And this is where I'm getting like OCD and like creative for no reason because I really don't need to make it anything look nice right now. <laughs> but I'm going to because it's what I do. I don't even need I don't even need a building right now. It doesn't even save me. I can't even build a bed. I have to sleep on my I have to sleep on my little raft. Nope, by baking a dock, surely dock is used can maintain and upgrade a raft. I can, make, I can make a dock. I can make a dock. 
That's something I definitely can do. No, I can't do. I thought I had more stuff than I do. I don't know where my planks have gone. I used them all up on the building. Darn. So I need... What do I need? I need 20 planks, 20 sticks, 20, 10 scrap metal. So what I need is, the, is this. I need the planks. I guess that's something we can save for a future ep. But right now, I should go down and craft. Well, not craft, I should harvest some more stuff, shouldn't I? I should sleep. I don't even feel like I need sleep in this game, but apparently I do. I get some more rope while I'm at it. So planks what I need. A nice selection of planks over here with some scrap metal from these chests. Directly below us, it's always here. But at least we've got some progress there. We've made like a bit of a raft. There's more than just nothing right now. Before we so this episode we kinda of had nothing. At this point I can survive so I know I know how to get like clean water. I know how to get cooked fish to eat. So I can keep all my levels, like survival levels, like whether that be first, hunger, sanity. I can keep them all going. So now I can survive. I'm self-sustainable, right? At this point it's about like just crafting, exploring, surviving. The survival part should be the easiest part. Because the sharks aren't going to attack me. I don't see any threats other than thirst and hunger. So that part's pretty easy. I see unless they update the game at some point. Let me grab these. Nice. I think that's all the... Oh, there's a chest here, isn't there? There's a chest there and there. Let me bang these chests out. Take this up. We'll see where we're at. We'll have like a final recoup for the episode. And then we'll end it off. Um... But we made some progress today, we learnt some stuff. We died, unfortunately, but we survived in the, in the, in the, long, in the long run. Because we respawned. So ultimately we're winning because we've learnt. We learnt that we can die. Maybe it's only once though, that's the next thing. The next question to be raised is can it happen more than once? We now know how to catch fish. We now know how to distill water without looking like an idiot. But to ensure that there are more... The family defence issue... Do I need defence really? I mean, what does, that, what does that actually block off? It's just a decorative item, nothing else. Uh, so, got myself my planks. Seaweed isn't necessary in, or rope isn't necessary in any of these either. No, one rope in that, that's what's needed. But I've got five rope there. And the seaweed always just gets stored in the drying rack, really, shouldn't it? Just run that, get one rope out of that. Uh, water, I need to get some clean water out. Use that. Use that. Fish is fine. Okay. Let's go over here. Um, it's a, oh, it's a dock I wanted to make, wasn't it? I'm able to make a dock right now. I'm not going to lie. I was cra I'm just crafting it. I just want to see what happens if I craft it because it, it gives me the next option of crafting stuff. I just want to see what I can craft. All right, docks my inventory. Come on, the exciting part. Oh, it's a whole full on thing. Oh my god. Snap it on. I don't know how to snap it on this way. No. It only snaps it in one place. I don't want it to snap on there. I should have to rotate it before. Sucks. Cause that's where my building's gonna be. I guess I'll just have to place. I'll try and time it perfectly. Ah, look, raft. Twenty planks, twenty rope, ten sticks. 
So I can probably get that. But that's 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 decent. That's decently on. It's it's not that far off. It looks like my raft there is part of the dock. You know, I've got a little I've got a dock for my raft. That means I can go explore and go to that one probably in the next video. I can make a raft and explore further. But for this episode, we basically just crafted some stuff. We got the drying rack sorted. Obviously, we got the water distillery thing sorted now. We got ourselves the little barbecue bucket. Other things we need to make still. Obviously, I can progress uh, my living space, my house, so to speak, even though I don't really need the house, uh, further in the next episode as well, uh, by adding some stairs, I can get some more platforms done, get some chests done for storage, and organizing stuff like that, like I always do in every game. Um, check out the window frames, put windows on the side. Uh, catwalk, let me know what that's gonna even, I mean, how long is catwalk, that's the thing. A rope ceiling. I get a boy, that means I can use both smart position for what well, I want to revisit later. So that's not really that necessary. And a crafting box, obviously, which I could probably move from the raft into the house. Um, but other than that, that was, will be where we're at. Um, so I think I'm going to leave it there. Um, but yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode. If you have, uh, then as always, please leave a like on it uh, to show your support. Leave a comment if you have any opinions on the game, any feedback to give. Anything you want to suggest for future, whether it be a game suggest for future, anything like that, always feel free to leave a comment that's more than just something simple like first, all right? Because they're the best comments. Comments that are actually interactive with the video are the best comments you'll ever get on, a vi on any video, and I love, they're the ones I love reading. Uh, so if you get some of those, that'd be sick. I always find you get a lot better comments on single player games anyway. That can maybe just more engaging in general, because I'm engaging with you and not the others. Um, but yeah, I'm going to leave it at that. Like I said, if you enjoyed, leave a like on it. I'll see you guys next time. Cool. Bye. I'm a Marcus, bare excitement, like it's a circus. Wanna see more exciting things? Check my YouTube channel or circus. If you hear something in my bar, you think I didn't even know that I said? Boy, better know when I'm on the mic and I speak, better know that I said it on purpose. That's right, I'm a Marcus, saying it again.